friends, and today I'm doing something a little bit different. Um, instead of running over the stats in the garage, I finally got this website to work on my phone, um, and I'm going to compare these tanks here. I'm going to be playing the M24 Chaffee today, the US Elite tank at tier 5, which is the worst in class. Um, right, I'm going to have them all with a gun rammer or vents, I'm not going to put anything else on them, and we're going to run through them. Alright, first off, we have damage per minute. The Chaffee is the lowest with 1,341. The Crusader is the highest with 1,916, and the VK's 1,474 is in between, but it's an auto loader, auto cannon, so, I mean, yeah, it, it's gonna have something. Um, but then if you switch over to APCR for all of them, can I, can I, can I switch? Thank you. Okay. Um, because APCR got damage nerf, and look at, look at how similar they are. The Leopard, once again, is ahead, but only by 48 damage per minute. And need I remind you that the penetration numbers matter, and Chaffee has 165 compared to the Leopard's 110. 165 is necessary at times to go through KV-1s at interesting angles, or T1 heavies, or tier 6 little heavies. Um, but look at the Crusader. The Crusader beats them all in all, almost all ex um, the gun categories, except for Alpha, Caliber, and Shell Velocity. So switch back to AP. Um, you have 115 millimeters of AP pen on the Chaffee, compared to 130 on the Crusader, and 95 on the Leopard. Um, 20 HE pen on the Chaffee compared to 15 on both of the others, but the Chaffee has a 76 millimeter instead of the 57 of the Crusader or 30 of the Leopard. Um, Leopard has a 12 shot clip with 3 shot burst, so there's that. Um, reload, the Chaffee has a very bad reload. 7.16 second reload on a 76 millimeter is, that's the only reason its DPM is so low. It's got 160 alpha compared to 90 and 25. It's because Wargaming nerfed it so that it would not have good alpha. Um, so yeah. Sorry, Discord uh, distracted me. Uh, rate of fire, 8.31. Um, disregard the Leopard's rate of fire because it's it's an auto cannon. 21.8 on the, 0.28 on the Crusader. So Crusader has better DPM, better rate of fire, better penetration. Um, better reload, it's got worse shell velocity, it's got lower caliber and lower alpha. The Crusader wins on gun stats. Um, the Leopard has a 10 second reload on its clip, but it's it's not bad. Yeah, the Chaffee so far sucks in fired power. And then we move on. Do we move on? Shall we move on? I did not miss anything, did I? So, so far the Chaffee fires has really good shell velocity, okay? Weapon handling, aim time, um, these numbers are not accurate. They're not what the game says, so I'm gonna say they're not accurate. Um, so we're not gonna, we're just gonna ignore them. Dispersion, 0.353 on the Chaffee is the middle ground between 0.308 on the Crusader and 0.371 on the Leopard. Leopard, once again, gun stand handling's not good because it's an auto cannon. You're not supposed to snipe with an auto cannon. Um, yeah. So, depression, you know, movement on movement, rotation, the Chaffee actually comes out on top. Chaffee is the best out of the bunch on uh, on firing on the move. So it can fire on the move, and it's got decent shell velocity. Uh, gun depression, it has 10 degrees, which is fantastic, but the Crusader outshines it with 12 degrees. Um, it only has 15 degrees of elevation compared to 20 on the other two. Um, Leopard, once again, has 10 degrees, so all of them have a really good gun depression and decent elevation. And then we move on to mobility. And here's where the Crusader kind of... I mean, it, its top speed is worse. It's got better horsepower, better power-to-weight ratio, better effective power-to-weight ratio. Um, better... same or better terrain resistances, and I have no idea what the no-bod traverse thing means. Um, the Leopard. The Leopard just... it can go 60 compared to 56 or 44. It can go 22 in reverse, which is the same as Crusader, but more than Chaffee. Uh, power weight ratio is 30.61. The Leopard weighs far more than either of the other two, and it has a far better power weight ratio. 
23.17 on the Crusader and a measly 22.44 on the Chaffee. Chaffee does not seem to go places quickly. Um, effective horsepower per ton depends on terrain resistances. For example, the Chaffee is the worst all across the board. The Leopard can, is really good on hard, really good on medium, and decent on soft. Then we have terrain resistances. Once again, yeah, Chaffee loses. Then, credit coefficient Chaffee, we don't have that income yet. The Leopard makes more credits than the Crusader. Uh, Chaffee is middle ground on view range. The Leopard has better view range. Leopard has the lowest amount of hit health. The Crusader has the most. Leopard has the most armor. Chaffee has the least. And then we have turret armor. Uh, Chaffee actually beats the Crusader inside of the turret armor. Um, but that's it. Leopard beats him in all of that. So... Look at that. Chaff oh, Chaffee weighs 19.61 tons. Crusader weighs 19.46. That's why there's such a significant difference in power to weight ratio. Uh, Leopard weighs 2 tons, two, 1 and a half tons more than either of these, but because it has another 200 horsepower, it's got a crazy half power to weight ratio. So, it is 9.54 p.m. if you've been paying attention to that. Um, so, yeah. With all that being said, let's move on to battles. Chaffee sucks, period. Alright, hopefully we can have my pl clanmate play with me. Okay. Uh, Chaffee, Chaffee, Chaffee. The uh, Mr. Swedish God um, is one of my clanmates. He's, yeah. He, re he really wanted to platoon because he's bored, and then I told him he had to buy a Chaffee, and he did. And uh, I think he's going to regret it, but uh, anyways, so we are top tier in a platoon on uh, Castilla, Castilla, Castilla. Chaffee, Chaffee, Chaffee. Um, we have a decent amount of damage output between us. Um, I'm taking forever to load into battle, I do not know why. Um, yeah. So I, I don't like this tank. This tank is is just a horrible excuse of a tank. Um, it's worse than the leopard, in all and pretty much everything except for penetration, alpha, and yeah, shell velocity and firing on the move, and dispersion. It's worse. It's worse than crusader and everything except for side of the turret armor, shell velocity, and firing on the move. Oh, and alpha. Yeah, that all-important alpha and HE penetration. But, uh, yeah, it's it's a horrible tank. I don't recommend this tank. Oh, we have matching camos. Oh, how cute. Um, so, the Chaffee, 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 is... Eh, it could be better. All right, so we picked up our first kill. Um, Stop talking about the Chaffee stats, you numpty. And start playing. <laughs> did what? Wait. Did one of our tanks jump off a cliff, or did he drown? If he did either of those, he's an idiot. I missed him, but my clan mate uh, picked up the kill. I'm gonna flank this T14. We're probably gonna have to use Pramo because T14. Well, I I've got his side and rear, so apparently I can still bounce. He's turning towards me. Set him on fire. Pop, pop adrenaline. Did three hundred damage. Switch to APCR. Um, my clanmate. Yep. L kept him low on roll down for leaving one eight health. I'm tr stumbling over my words. And my clanmate picked up the kill. Good. So far. APCR, um, because APCR's damage is reduced, it cost me a kill, but I'm fine with that. T14 died without doing severe damage to either of us, really. Um, enemy Covenanter is... I'm I'm having weird leg spikes. Um, it's been happening all night. I don't know why. Uh, I'm not, I don't want to cap, of course, because... We have this in the bag. 
Uh, my clan may picked up another kill. Pop a shot into that guy. I can pop another one before he turns his turret towards me. And there. Uh, BIA, as long as both of us survive. The Covenanter is over here, so I'll go and find him. I'm hoping he's an idiot. Yeah, I'll, I'll let him get the top gun if possible. I'm spotted. He's over here. I don't know. Don't think he was paying attention. Um, let's see. I think he climbed the hill. Um, it may be that he didn't climb the hill, um, but most likely he did. So far, we've we've, we've had a fairly decent match. Um, that fire on the T14 really helped my damage. He had ours. No, I, I, I thought so. We're firing AP, right? Come on. Come on, Swedish. There, Swedish got a top gun. We got a crucial and a brothers. Um Yep. They brought back global chat in three point nine and chat after your death. Which is i I guess is nice. Um I got a second class. He got a second class. He got more XP than me. Um Okay. Yeah, yeah. Okay, let's let's move on. Okay, um, we'll play a couple more battles. So far, we've gotten two for two, and the first one was a decent battle. Second one was mm, average. Uh, yeah. Okay, top tier once again on this map. They have a KV one platoon T fourteen, so they have heavies. Um, hopefully we'll, we can flank them, kill their mediums and lights, and, uh, yeah. Because we have the medium of tank advantage, medium slash light advantage. Uh, Chaffee is not really a light tank, it's more of a medium. It's more of a worse M4 or M7. Yep. Left it is, because left is smart. T67 is also a, a really fast tank destroyer, so it's more of medium. Just does not have good turret traverse rates, and, yeah. I mean, its armor is basically the same as a Chaffee. In thickness, I think. Maybe less. Who knows. Um, traverse rates on this thing, I don't... I'm, yeah. I, uh, I'm i just hoping to grind, finish grinding it tonight, sell it tonight, and then never play it again. I wish I could do voiceover commentary because then I could be communicating with my platoon mate right now. And, uh, you know, less stress of the battle, less awkward pauses, and all that. Okay, so our leopards are, their leopard, not our leopard, is, is wrecked. And here comes the Covenanter. Don't know how that shot missed, but it did, so we'll deal with it. You can see that I'm struggling to reverse up this slope, and... Uh, yeah, aim for his engine deck. I don't I don't think I tracked him. If I did, I'm happy for that, but I'm pretty sure whoever hit him after me did. Okay, so we have a leopard no not a leopard, a panzer. Somebody's H E cannon. Uh probably our M4. One health and he survives. Who? <sighs> this stupid M4. Um, so this game is bad for me. If that guy, if, if somebody had rolled for one health higher, I could have survived. Instead, this M4 back here needs to die. Um, my involvement in the game ended rather quickly. I did nothing, so I may cut this battle out. Depends on how well my platoon mate does. And yeah, here comes the KV ones and the T fourteen most likely. Okay, our KV one picked up a kill. Good, good, good. Uh, we have two derp cannons, one hundred five millimeter howitzers, uh, Panzer four and M four. So my plan mate's doing something smart, of course. Uh, I mean, hopefully he knows how to play. 
Otherwise, I wouldn't be platooning with him. That's our right Swedish potato. 130, uh, what's the lowest average of 160? You can roll for 120. 120 is the minimum roll, supposedly, I think. Um, we lost our KV-1, so now it's medium tanks versus two KV-1s and a T-14. T-14 is useless. Um, my platoon mate should be able to take care of him pretty easily because my platoon mate is not spotted to my knowledge. I don't think he is, uh, or the T-14 is ignoring him, but I'm pretty sure he's not spotted. So he puts another shot in. Yeah, I forgot, rate of fire sucks, 7.2 second reload. 7.16 to be more accurate. Uh, let's see. He missed. Mm, this guy's a one-shot, that guy's a one-shot, that guy's a not a one-shot. Uh, we lost one. Mm, this is not good. This is not good. My clanmate has to carry very, very hard without taking damage. Much damage. Kill that guy? Good. Focus that guy, hopefully, and end him, and then the other KV-1's a 1v3. Oh, that low roll. He's got the 57, so he'll take another hit. And he bounced. He'll take a third hit. He'll probably take a fourth. Turn, 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 shoot him. But he took another hit. Um, He needs to avoid the KV-1. Our M4. Yes, our M4 needs to push, please. Nice, he's using APCR now, so 124 damage. Um, yeah, don't do that, don't do that. You need to stay al Oh, no. Oh, that's... He just needs to back off. And KV-1 missed. He needs to get into cover as fast as possible. Unfortunately, this thing's not very fast. And our... Yeah. I right, so my clanmate has to do three or four shots of damage. He could go for the draw, but that's boring. Um, at least I hope he's not going for the draw. There he is, four hundred and ten health, three shots, maybe f probably four. Yep, that's nice. Two more like it. One more like it. No, one more better, higher damage roll. I believe the KV-1's using the 88, 85. Come on, come on, KV-1. The clanmate's playing very smart, hopefully. Um, I think he's typing. Okay. <laughs> Twenty seconds. Uh, he does not have time. Uh, I believe this is gonna be a draw. Ten seconds. Yeah, he's not fast enough. If I were him, I would have stayed there, and yeah. Oh well. Yep. I just realized I turned the countdown be when, when I press the record button to when it actually starts recording to five seconds. That's probably a problem. Uh.
Let's see, 7,200 XP to go. And then I'm done with this tank. Uh, I'm, I don't think I'll include the draw. The draw was not great. Um, okay, so we're top tier. Oh! Oh, I know what's going on here. I very much know what's going on here. Oh, yeah. Mm, doing some of that stuff, hey? Let's see how he responds. Oh, he has an S35 now. I didn't realize that. In, in case any of you haven't, don't know, he, he is my very, 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 very good friend. And uh, yeah, I've been in some of his videos. I think he's been in some of my videos. He's a salty person, but uh, aren't we all at heart? Okay, so I just spotted five enemies. Um, I don't want to stick around. Sticking around seems a bit dangerous. Uh, I'm gonna sh I'm gonna shoot this Panzer IV D instead because isolated tanks are easy targets. Let's see. That's in fact six of their seven tanks. Who is not spotted? All of them have been spotted. Okay. Wow, that was a nice shooting, Tex. All right. So now I'm be I'm gonna get behind this rock and I'm gonna use my gun depression. Uh, they've already lost a tank, which is good. I hopefully got a scout medal, but who knows. Um, I'm going to shoot the side of your turret. Pop adrenaline since you're ignoring me. Put another shot in because you're ignoring me. And kill him. Okay. So now we're on our team's at three kills. Yeah, because of the nice shell velocity on this gun, I did hit that shot. And you can see that the, the spaced armor on the mantlet is actually working in our favor there. Um, 188. Killed him because of nice shell velocity. Uh, sitting on two kills. I wonder if Crimson's recording. He may be. I think he is. He said something about recording, so... Probably he is, and if if so, you should probably check out his video. I'll probably link it in the description if he is. Of course, it depends on when he releases it because I plan on releasing this two days from now, and I don't I don't think he does. Um, my platoon mates got two kills, so it's a BIA. My platoon mate got <laughs> YOLO. Oh, my keyboard takes forever to load up. Ugh, I hate that. That's the reason I don't type in in-game chat. I'll type outside of battle, but battle chat, uh, I can't work. Okay, I got a scout, a BIA, and oh, look at this. He got a steel wall. How special. I did uh, second most damage. He beat me by barely anything. Um, yeah. Um, apparently, we're doing countdowns now, and I'm not part of them. I'm just taking along. So you'll get to see them. Um, hopefully... Hopefully we get Crimson on the enemy team and I get to destroy him. Eh, he's on our team. Um, how many battles have I recorded? A lot. Yeah, I probably... This is probably going to be the last battle recorded, so let's see. I played five in a platoon, one of which you're not going to see. I think. Probably. Okay, so you can see already that the Leopard is incredibly, incredibly more mobile. It gets up to speed faster, it goes faster, it traverses better, it's got better ground resistances. Yeah, this thing is not a light tank. I just, I just don't understand what Wargaming did to it, because on PC it's actually a decent tank. Um, it certainly does not have a 7.2 second reload. It's got... I, I, it's got something faster, but then again, it only does 110 on PC compared to 160 here. Um, and then it doesn't have as much health on PC. It also used to get mass matched up against tier 8s. 
Thank you. And he used HE. HE only has 20 millimeters of penetration. The T40 actually does have decent armor. Um, all right, I need to get moving. Light tank that's camping in the back is not a good light tank. I got a scout medal last battle. I'm not going to get a scout this battle. Okay, I'm going to ignore those and turn around. Uh, Stock Chaffee versus me. Uh, I've got a better rate of fire. I'm pretty sure he doesn't have a 100% crew. Look at that shot. That shot sh was in nice. I mean, crew skills did help. Um, I'm going to stay in cover, hopefully. What? Ugh. He hit at that angle with HE and penned. And did like 450. So, and then my platoon mate dies, and it's all left on this scrub's shoulders. He can kill the SU, good. DW2 is a bit of a problem. He can outrun everybody left. Uh, Panzer IV does have the derp, which is, uh, if, if he stops and kills a Panzer IV, that'd be nice, but I don't think he does. Uh, SU85. He's just going to try to run, and... What? <laughs> okay, so now he's got to kill the M4 and circle the DW. Oh, uh, that, that MRX probably won us the game. Nice little slide, and then he turns to throw them off the trail. He's hoping to isolate them, and preferably the Panzer IV first. Um, I played with him a lot. My game froze. Similar to 38% chance to win. What on earth are you talking about, Panzer IV-D? You may be a math wizard, but I'm sure you don't know the stats of people. Okay, if, he's, if he stops, doesn't take a hit from this 105. Ooh, that's nice. Unfortunately, he did not pen all of his shots, or at least not all of them did damage, so there's that. Um, he's now unspotted. That's good. He's going to circle, try to get the pan to the Panzer IV without getting to the DW. 30%. I don't know what this Panzer IV D is on. Um, this is a good battle for the Leopard driver, Mr. Crimson De Discord. Discord. He used to be Crimson Death, and... and Oh, that screws my mind up so much. I've been recording for a good hour, haven't I? Eh, a good 40 minutes. Oh, that was nice. And he set him on fire. He's got this. He's gonna win. Unless he gets ammo ranked. 59... what? Um, yeah, so I got carried... Unfortunately, he didn't pen a lot, but he can finish him off with his next clip, and yeah, DW2, DW2, it's all over for you. So that was a nice call of Banos. Yeah, five kills, that Amorak won him the game. Uh, he's going to be bragging about that. Um, 400. Oh, no. Mm. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. This is bad for me. He did fire 123 shots. Wow. Uh, mo a lot of his damage did come from that Amorak. If he had an Amorak, that guy, it probably could have turned out very differently. Um, where's that Panzer 4D? Okay. So yeah, um, anyways, ladies and gentlemen, that's going to be it for me for today. I believe I recorded enough footage. Um, so with all that being said and done, I hope you all enjoyed this video. And if you did, please don't forget to hit the like button as it shows you are interested in this stuff. And comment down below. Um, Crimson, if you comment, I scared you scrub, I'm going to murder you. Um...
and uh, uh, that screwed me up. And tanks you want me to see. I will be playing the T-37 probably for my next video. And um, yeah. Also, subscribe if you're new. I don't think I said that. And uh, yeah, with that, with that, I'm going to have to say see y'all. Have fun. Stay safe.